Shifting focus now to some breaking news that's coming in and there seems to be a curious case of ministers in the Chinese government going missing. Now after we saw the absence of the foreign minister, now we're given to understand that the whereabouts of the defence minister are also under question. The defence minister of China, Li Shangfu, seems to be missing in action is what we're now learning. The US ambassador to Japan, in fact, has uh, put out a tweet which we will be sharing with you in just a short while from now. Uh, the US ambassador to Japan, in fact, brought this to notice, uh, speaking about the political instability in China, going on to say that the defense minister, Li Shangfu, has not been seen in public for the last two weeks. There is no word really coming in from the Chinese side just as yet. Abhishek, my colleague, joining us, getting us more details. Abhishek, what more can you share with us? Uh, are there any details that are trickling in uh, apart from what uh, the US ambassador has claimed? Uh, uh, no, for now we know that uh, Chinese defense minister's uh, public appearance has been very limited in the recent times. But exactly if he's been removed or he's been replaced is yet not clear. Uh, we have recent development in Chinese uh, you know, political system where we saw uh, King Gang, the, for, uh, the former foreign minister who was sidelined in a very uh, you know, uh, subtle way. Uh, like for weeks he was not seen uh, in a public uh, space and then in one fine morning it was told that Wang Yi, the, uh, the, the last foreign, uh, foreign minister, will be uh, furnishing the duties of King Gang and he'll be the foreign minister. So that was how King Gang was actually removed from his office and so far there has been no explanation why or on like whether any corruption charges was against him or like on, on what ground he was removed. Same has been the case with the uh, uh, commander of the rocket forces of China, uh, the the one who was who also went missing, and there has been no uh, you know information regarding this. Now Chinese Defense Minister Li Shangfu is also missing from public layer, and for the last two weeks there has not been any event where he has appeared. Uh, and now the rumors are rife that maybe he is also one of the victims of the Chinese, uh, you know, hidden uh, political system where things are decided in a way which nobody understands, at least publicly. And a lot of the development, a lot of the political legends are taken behind the curtain. And this is all. This also seems to be one of the reasons. And we know that Chinese President Xi Jinping did not travel to India to take part in G20 summit level talks, and it was said. Uh, one of the many theories that why didn't he attend the G20 summit was that he was having too many issues, political issues to handle with at home. And probably that was one of the reasons that stopped him from traveling uh, for two, three days to a destination where uh, his uh, domestic affairs were more important than the G20 summit. And he sent Li Qiang, the, the prime minister, to India and he did not come himself. So probably uh, that theory could be true that the political system uh, or the political uh, compulsions in China were far more, uh, you know, urgent for the Chinese president to travel to India and the disappearance or for that matter, not appearance of Chinese uh, defense minister Li Xunfu for two weeks does tell a different story that probably all is not well with the cabinet of uh, Xi Jinping in China. Right, Abhishek, do stay on with us because I just want to get in uh, what the US uh, ambassador to Japan has now come out and tweeted. And this is the tweet that we are putting out for our viewers. He goes on to say, President Xi's cabinet lineup is now resembling an Agatha Christie novel. Then there were none. That is a novel that uh, he is going on to quote. He says, first the foreign minister goes missing, then the rocket force commanders go missing. And now the defense minister hasn't been seen in public for the, for the last two weeks. Who's going to win this unemployment race is the question the U.S. ambassador is asking there, uh, China's youth or Xi's cabinet. The mystery there continues and Abhishek, until the Chinese administration uh, or the Chinese foreign ministry perhaps comes out uh, and gives out some sort of clarification, rumours like this are only going to uh, escalate further. Abhishek? We'll try and reconnect with my colleague Abhishek there. But for now, uh, this is the latest that we can share with you as far as uh, the curious case of several uh, within the Xi Jinping administration going missing is concerned. We'll keep a track of that and much more here on CNN News 18. For now, a quick break.